Welcome to the Primitive Lifeways channel. In today's video, I want to discuss the edible uses for Indian paintbrush, which just sits right by my feet here. This is a really good plant to know about. So stick around and I'll be right back with you. All right, folks, so I want to welcome you back. You can see we have a nice, healthy cluster of Indian paintbrush. And this really likes to grow in this area. It's pretty abundant, especially in these grassy fields out here. So besides extracting a pigment out of this plant, what I like to do is I like to gather these tops. You see this little green top coming out of the flower throughout its structure. And I'll just pull this up like this and I'll suck the nectar from the inside of the flower. And it's a nice little sugar boost. So the best way that I can describe the taste, oh man, that one was loaded. It's like uh, Ocotillo flowers or Ocotillo nectar. Oh man, just super, super sweet. That is excellent. That one's a little dry. Some of them, you don't get much. Mmm, that is good. But most of these are producing well. Just a beautiful, beautiful taste. Just like pure cane sugar. Really, really sweet. All right, folks, so that's just about going to wrap this video up. I do appreciate you joining me. I'm Jeff with PrimitiveLifeways.com, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Well, I couldn't resist. One of my favorite plants out here, squawberry. Mmm, those are amazing. Nice and ripe, bright red. Just super sweet. Mmm. Absolutely one of my favorite treats of the desert. Oh my God, phenomenal.